this is your treatment plan. More patients are having the kind of conversation Jerry Gill of Goshen recently had with Dr. Tim Tress. There's different ways to get marijuana in your body, okay. and they don't want you smoking it. They would rather have you vape it. Vaping, you feel it in five, one to five minutes, and it lasts for about three hours. When I stopped by Tress's office in Sharonville, he was recommending Gill use cannabis for chronic pain. It's a recommendation Tress has made repeatedly to people who may not be familiar with what Tress calls the benefits of marijuana. Some people have, you know, they smoked it when they were a teenager and haven't touched it in 50 years, so they're, they, they really don't know much about it. At the moment, flowering buds are the only kind of marijuana patients in Ohio can legally buy. That's about a change since a processing plant near Zanesville can start making products that look like these, made at a facility I visited in Illinois. I saw lab workers create all kinds of concoctions like these marijuana-infused gummy bears. Patients in the Buckeye State should start seeing similar looking edibles along with oils, tinctures and patches in the coming months. Lab manager Liz Greisel told me having more ways to consume cannabis should help patients have a more tailored medical experience. I can see it being like this is what my condition is and then kind of making almost a custom medicine for people based on what that is. Tress agrees but says it will take time to get to that point. There's so many moving parts in this whole system that it's going to take a while. Well, Ohio's medical marijuana program is not known for moving quickly. So far, just that one processing plant out of 38 in all has received permission to start making different forms of cannabis. Todd Dykes, WWT News 5.